Hi there students. To be at loggerheads. Okay, if two people are at loggerheads, they are arguing, they are disputing. There is a problem between them. Maybe they have negotiated and they have come to an impasse, a position beyond which neither will go and they can't make any more further progress and then they begin to argue. <laughs> and so maybe the British government are at loggerheads with each other about Brexit. Okay, They are arguing and they don't know how to progress the situation. So to be at loggerheads with someone, to be arguing with someone, to be in strife and combat with them, but not physically fighting and punching, it's arguing and disagreeing. Okay, so to be at loggerheads with someone. What about the origin of this phrase? Well, I don't know, I'm sure you know the word a log is a piece of wood. And apparently in the olden days, a logger was a big block of wood that you used to tie to your horse, to the leg of your horse, so it couldn't run away. So logger head, big block of wood for a head. Yeah, okay. And uh, that's the origin. I guess then uh, neither party will move because they are blockheads, if you like. To be at loggerheads, to be arguing with someone, to be at a position where you can make no progress with them. So <coughs> the negotiations between the management and the union broke down. They were at loggerheads over how overtime was to be paid. Okay, To be at loggerheads with someone. Yeah, so, um, yes, bef maybe before a war starts, firstly, the two groups are at loggerheads with each other. They are arguing with each other. Now, what about formality? I think to be at loggerheads, it's probably neutral, maybe ever so slightly informal, but probably an, of neutral formality. So you can probably use it anywhere. You could even probably write it. And notice the preposition to be at loggerheads, not in or on, to be at loggerheads with someone. By the way, a loggerhead is also a type of turtle, yeah? But there's nothing to do with this one. So, I don't know, I'm at loggerheads with my friend because he borrowed my car and then he crashed it. And now he refuses to help me to get a new car. Okay, so we're at loggerheads. We are, yeah, in a state of strife and argument and, uh, yeah, heavy discussion, if you like. But we can't seem to make any progress. To be at an impasse and then the arguing starts. So anyway, I hope you're not at loggerheads with anyone during this Christmas. If you enjoyed the video, give it a rating, subscribe to my channel, and I'll see you soon. Bye for now. To be at loggerheads with someone.